Hey everybody, hope everybody's doing good and well out there. Today, we're going to put new side graphics on the door on the rockers there. Um, it's not a big project, it's just you gotta do it the right way or you do it the wrong way. It kind of gets jacked up if you don't get it on there right. So sometimes it's a challenge if you don't know what you're doing and I, I'm not the best. I did it a before on my 300. Show you that out here. There's my 300, so I did the, the rocker graphics on the side of that. So I'm pretty confident I can get these. I'm just taking this off. As you can see here, they put uh, Mach 1 graphics on. It's not a Mach 1, it's a GT. They didn't come out with the Mach 1s between 05 and oh shoot, until now, 2020. I believe 2021, they're gonna come out with a Mach 1 model. But uh, they stopped making those in 2004 so today's project is to pull that off and put some new graphics on i have some over here i washed the side of the cars right there so when i put my masking tape on that'll stick next pro next uh, step i guess you'd say would be to pull those graphics off wash that surface and then i'm going to take some alcohol rub that on real well to get all the imperfections out of there and then stick on some new stuff and hopefully it turns out well so stand by and hope you enjoy the video Okay, as you can see, I put some masking tape to give me some guidelines when I lay the graphics over that. And the cool thing about these is they actually came in sections. So I got my four sections that are here. One for the front fender area, the rear quarter, on both sides of the door. And then down here, I've got my two, if I can separate them, there we go got the two graphics for the door and there's plenty of room plenty of plenty 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 of uh graphics tape so i can actually cut a little if i might need to but i'm just going to lay it in the middle as best i can and then do the do the work so the rest of this work will be me tearing this off and reapplying Okay, it is finished. Wow, that stuff was on a little harder than I thought, but it did come off. Uh, I got the blue tape on there to mark where I'm going to place the, the top, but as you can see, it came off. So the next step is I'm gonna I'm gonna wash down the side of this car real quick with some soap and water, and I'm gonna take some alcohol and rub this whole area here. Try to get every bit of you know dirt and debris, any kind of thing that will stick to the paint. Uh, try to get all that off when I put the alcohol on there. And then the uh, next step will be to place on the stripes. So onward, all the graphics are off. So we're gonna take some, um, some of this alcohol. I've got my wife's makeup remover pads, so it won't leave near any residue, flakes, whatever. Gonna rub that all across the bottom of that, get it all squeaky clean. And we'll place those graphics on there, so uh, we'll get to it. Hey guys, flash forward to the next day. Um, I'm hurting. I was on my butt a lot when I was doing this, uh, and but I got it off. I got it all clean. Everything's smooth. So as you can see, the 
Mach 1 is gone now and we got straight stripes. So I'm pretty happy with the turnout. Um, so yeah, this is why I didn't have the progression of me doing all that. It would have took forever and I, my battery was going dead. There's just a lot of things that happened on this when I did it, but um, for the most part, it turned out pretty well. I was pretty excited. Sorry if there's a wind noise, but I got a fan going on over here, but um, I got it parked right now. But uh, sorry, this wasn't the best video that I could do. What's up, Jackie? Jackie Chan. Um, so anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the content. Um, I enjoyed doing it. It just takes a lot out of you. You're uh, constantly on the ground on your butt. I'm an old man, so it was rough going for a while there. But uh, got it all done. I'm pretty pleased with it. I'm hoping next that I can get me some lowering springs, pan hard bar, and I'm going to get uh, some smoke tail lights for the back. So those are my next three. There we go. My next three things that I want to do to this, and then obviously some wheels and tires. From what we got, I don't mind these rims and tires, but I know we definitely got to get rid of that wheel gap. And uh, thanks again for watching, guys. I appreciate it. Uh, please hit the like and subscribe button and even the notification bell, man. What the heck? All right. Love you guys. Have a good one.